Preparatory phase. Clip fingernails. Remove jewelries. Examine hands and forearms for cuts and blemishes. Complete OR attire with cap, face mask, and eye gear or face shield. Adjust eye gear or face shield to fit comfortably in relation to the face mask. Fold scrub suit sleeves. Pre-wash. Using the sensor-operated faucet, turn on water. Wet hands and forearms. Pour liquid soap on palm of one hand. Lather hands and arms thoroughly with antiseptic solutions up to 2 inches or 5 centimeters away or above elbow for up to 1 minute. Rinse thoroughly, keep hands upward. Scrub time method. Take a sterile brush from the dispenser. Wet the sterile brush. Obtain liquid soap from the dispenser. Begin scrubbing. Ensure quality of mechanical friction, circular motion in scrubbing following anatomical pattern. Palm of the hand surfaces of its fingers beginning from the thumb to the fifth finger. Nails in between fingers. Dorsal surface of the hand. Wrist and up the arms in thirds. Ending two inches above the elbow. Repeat the procedure using the other hand. Rinse hands and arms by keeping hands above elbow. Hands up and in front. Enter the door with your back. Enter the door with your back. Dry hands and arms. Pick up sterile towel without touching anything else. Move backward away from the sterile field at least 12 to 16 inches. Allow towel to unfold. Bend slightly forward. Be careful that the towel will not touch your scrub suit. Hold towel in the opposite hand while drying the hand in an oscillating motion from fingers, hands, arms.
two inches above the elbow. Reverse towel carefully. Draw the opposite arm following the same manner. Drop the used towel in the kick bucket. Dunning of surgical gown. Reach down to the sterile back table and lift the folded gown directly upward, not beyond shoulder level. Avoid over manipulation of the sterile gown. Step back away from the table into an unobstructed area. Hold the folded gown at the shoulder level. Carefully locate the neck band and arm holes. Hold the inside of the gown just below the neck band with both hands. Let gown unfold. Keep the inside of the gown towards the body. Hold hands at shoulder level. Slip both hands into armhole simultaneously. Leave cuff of leaves extended over the hands. Post gloving. Use dominant hands inside the gown to pick up folded edge for the non-dominant hand. Hold non-dominant hand palm up inside the gown. Position glove on the palm of the non-dominant hand. Use non-dominant hand inside the gown to grasp bottom, fold or cuff. Use dominant hand inside the gown to pull glove cuff over the gown and work hand into gloves should cover the cuff of the gown. Glove other hand correctly. Reposition fingers as needed. Dolphin, ask the circulating nurse to unfasten the neck and back closures of the gown. Grasp the shoulders of the gown and pull it downward from the shoulders and off the arms. Turn the sleeves inside out. Fold the contaminated surface of the gown to the inside and roll it away from the body. Discard the rolled gown in the appropriate receptacle. Remove the gloves from both hands together. Use glove to glove and skin to skin technique. Dispose the used gloves in the designated waste bin. Reach down to the sterile back table and lift the apron directly upward. Step back away from the table into an unobstructed area. Hold the apron carefully, locating the neck band. Hold the inside of the apron just below the neck band with both hands. Let apron unfold. Flip the neck strap towards the head, releasing the apron once the circulator takes hold of the neck strap and grasp the tip of the tie of the apron. Maintain hands on upward position and maintain sterile technique. Open gloving. Open wrapper observing a septic technique. Pick up first glove by touching only the folded cuff. Put on first glove without allowing touching any other part of the glove. Pick second glove from under the cuff with fingers only 
on the other glove hand. Put on second glove with bare hands, touching only the inside of the glove. Turn up cuff, touching the glove hands only to outside of the other glove. Reposition fingers as needed using a septic technique. Duffing of apron and gloves, and fasten the strap of the apron by the circulator. Remove neck strap and roll the apron. Discard used apron to waste bin. Remove gloves using glove to glove, skin to skin technique. Discard used glove to waste bin.